Hello everyone. The book we are going to read today is My Happy Year. This book is written by Paul Meisel. This book is narrated by Easton Bluebird. Birds that are blue in color are considered as symbol of happiness for more than thousands of years. And in this book, we will learn about the life cycle of the Easton Bluebird. June 1st, today is my birthday. I can't see it when I stick my head up and open my beak. Mom and Dad feed me. It feels like there are other little birds around me. Mom stays with us to keep us warm when she is not getting food. June 4, I still can't see eating lot of bugs. I'm growing fast. June 6th, I can see now and there are three other baby birds. We eat almost all day long. Beetles, crickets, caterpillars, grasshoppers, moths, spiders. Yum! June 7th, mom isn't sleeping with us anymore. Some feathers are starting to grow. I can see my wings. At night, we sleep close to stay warm. June 9th, eating all these bugs makes me poop. Mom takes my poop sack out of the nest. Good thing it gets pretty yucky in here. June 14th, I have real wings now. The others are talking about leaving the nest. I like it in here. It's safe. A big bird comes by and looks inside. He's too big to reach us, so he flies away. Phew! He looked hungry. June 18th, it's getting too crowded. One of us is ready to leave. He hops to the hole and jumps. He flaps his wings and falls to the ground. Mom tells him to get up and fly. He flaps some more and flies to the branch where dad is. June 19th, the others leave the nest too. They flap and flap and fly up into a tree. I don't want to leave yet. I'm afraid. June 20, I can see mom and dad feeding my siblings up in a tree. Mom comes to feed me too. She wants me to leave the nest, but I still don't want to. June 21, where's my family? I can hear them singing, but I can't see them. I'm hungry, but mom hasn't come with any food. Okay, it's time to be brave. I stand in the hole, take a deep breath and jump. I flap and flap. I'm flying. I land in a tree. My family comes. July 4th. Flying is amazing. Through the trees, over the meadows and streams, Everything is so beautiful from up here. September 14th. Fall is coming. Mom tells me that it's time to go someplace warm. September 28th. I see a flock of bluebirds. We are going south. I catch up with my family just in time. October 4th, so much flying, we stop to rest. Luckily, there are more bugs here than back home. Then we are on our way again. October 7th, we made it. It's warm and sunny. Lots of tasty bugs. Cats too. I have to be careful.
February 27th. Months have passed. The days are getting longer. Guess what? It's time to travel back north. A flock of bluebirds gather and we are off. March 12th. I'm home. It's still cold out, but there are lots of berries to eat. April 29th. It's getting warmer. Time to look for a mate. I find one and he picks a pretty house for us. May 15th, I build a nest out of grass while he guards the house. May 22nd, I lay five perfect blue eggs. I sit on them in a couple of weeks. My chicks will hatch. June 4th, look at my beautiful chicks. I'm so happy. Wow. That's a great book about the Eastern Bluebird. Hope you all enjoy reading this book. Bye for now. Until next book. See you all.